Jay Cooley with the Stooley back at the Comic Fox. We're covering Titans number two. We're picking up with the death of Wally West. With all that being said, let's get it. So for some reason that I don't know, this picks up with the past Titans. But we pick up with the Teen Titans as they're fighting Brother Blood. And Brother Blood is caught by the Justice League. Then we pick back up with the death of Wally West. And everyone is just in a complete shock of just how this happened. But then we see Wally, and actually, this isn't what you think, because Nightwing claims this could be Wally from the future, possibly. Titans call Oracle Barbara Gordon, and she informs them about an explosion, and this Wally decides to stay with Nightwing to basically just see the body. And then we transition to the Titans checking on the explosion. Then we see Beast Boy trying to save some monkeys, which he does. And then Raven and Cyborg help also with that. Starfire finds the people responsible, but Cyborg lets her know that she's wrong and that it was actually a Tamaranian. Tamaranians are the race that Starfire is from, but we pick up at Titans Tower as they are watching TV. And then they see Brother Blood. If you don't know Brother Blood, he's just a longtime Titans villain. Back to Brother Blood, who wants to fund to keep humans alive, and he even has a Titan sponsor in Tempest, the original Aqualad. And I must say, for a very slow-paced uh, story, this was actually a pretty good story. I mean, it really makes you wonder on what's going on with the past Titans, Brother Blood, the death of Wally West, Tamaranians, Starfire... I mean, Raven, like, what's even going on anymore in the Titan story? But I guess we're going to find out. With all that being said, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below what y'all thought of this comic, and I'm out. Peace.